G'day Sagittarius, welcome to TJ Tarot Down Under. Gonna do the love energy coming towards you as at now. See what's going on, eh? Decks I'm using today will be listed below in the description box in the order that I'm using them in case you are interested. I'm gonna do the reading a little bit different today. It's the same reading, you're still gonna get all the information. Um, I'm just gonna deal the cards out a bit quicker. All right, let's go. Give me three cards for the love energy coming towards Sagittarius, please. There's one. Oop. Two more, please. There's two. And one more. Three. Right, we'll do the bottom of that in a minute. Now we're going to get the clarifiers and then we're going to read them out. Yeah, read them together. Now, bone to pick. <laughs> Over 80% of my viewers, you guys, are not subscribed. So you're watching, but you're not subscribing. Come on. 80%? That's massive. Come on. It's free. Just click that button. <laughs> Hit the bell as well. <laughs> um, yeah, it costs you nothing. Come on. <laughs> Cheeky buggers. All right. Card number one. For the love energy coming towards Sagittarius, please. Yes, so cheeky. I mean, you keep coming back to watch, but... Card number two. And card number three. Okay. All right. So let's go. True love, this is a romance of a lifetime. Ooh, Sagittarius, someone sees you as their true love. We've got the Wheel of Fortune and the Three of Swords. Wow, they're really hoping the wheel turns in their favour with you and they don't get their heart broken. Yeah, hoping that, yeah, they see you as a true love, but they're really hoping that the wheel doesn't break their heart again. This doesn't turn out to be another heartbreak. Oh dear, that's a bit sad. Oh. Forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. Okay. Hmm. Six of Swords, Page of Cups, and the Five of Cups. Wow. Yeah, this could have been something that was a true love. But over time, you've both got your hearts broken here. They're giving and learning because we've got... They're wanting to move on to apologize for the disappointment here. Mm, that's all I'm getting from that. It's short and sweet. No, not so sweet. Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith with the King of Swords. Wow. Well, he's sitting there like the Justice card, really, isn't he? He's got the scales and he's got the sword. Trust it. You'll accept their truth and things can be balanced out between you two. Hmm. Wow. Seeing you as their true love, hoping enough times gone by since the heartbreak between you two, wanting that forgiveness to move on 
to apologize for the disappointment that they caused you and trying to trust that you can be honest with each other and have an adult conversation and balance this situation out. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Heart to heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. Yeah. Past life relationship. You've known each other before. And religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. So I'm hearing they're really trying to stay optimistic here that you two can have an honest discussion with each other about your feelings. And that that love in the past is something that you still believe in. That's what I'm hearing. Let's see, it's at the bottom of this one. Mm, strength card. Ten of Pentacles. The World card. And the Death card. Wow. Three major arcana out of four. Wow, yeah, they're hoping that this relationship is strong enough... To get back to that long-term commitment and stability between you two. To close out the cycle of whatever this disappointment is and transform this back into what it was. Well, to be stronger and more stable. And to close out this ending between you two. Mmm. Okay. Yeah, mm, someone wants to um, at least try and talk about this, because I still love you. They're hoping to get your trust back again. Mm. Give me three more cards for the love energy coming towards Sagittarius, please. Two more, please. Oh, one more. There we go. That was quick. Even quicker than quick. <laughs> Super quick. Hmm. All right. Let's get the clarifiers for this. These cards. Animal card number one. Clarification, please, for the love energy coming towards Sagittarius, please. Thank you. I'm really going to have to stick that on there, I think. It's been falling down through all these readings. All right. Card number two. Oh, that's way too much. The Otter, Surrender, Let Go of Control. Mm. With the Hierophant and the Knight of Wands. Yeah, they're, they're trying to surrender this and let go of the need to control the connection, the commitment. What the beliefs, yeah. I'm just getting commitment from this. And the passionate actions. Trying to control all the actions of. I mean, we've got commitment and we've got a player here, basically. Like of control. Surrender. But which one? Let go of the playaways, let go of the commitment. (sighs) 
Yeah, I'm just getting surrender to the connection and stop trying to control all the actions. Hmm. Control every action of the situation. Maybe they were too controlling in the past. Kangaroo, gratitude, be grateful for all you are blessed with. Let's see. Oh, five of wands, conflicted. Five of cups, two fives. Two of wands. And temperance, that's your card, Saji. So, yeah. After all the fighting, the disappointment, and the indecisions, they are still grateful for you. Oh, yeah. Mm. Grateful for that time they had with you. Still, yeah, really appreciative of your patience as well. And the turtle retreat. Stop trying to make something happen. With the five of swords. And the queen of swords. Yeah. So yeah. They're, they're, they're going to stop trying to. Play mind games. Manipulation. Win at any cost. Control this situation. Because yeah. They're going to stop trying to make something happen. Because they're just sabotaging everything here. They want to come correctly. I mean, this is the Queen of Swords. You come correctly or she cuts you out of her life because she's been hurt by all the swords. She keeps one to protect herself. So, yeah. Yeah, they're going to... Yeah, they're going to stop trying to make something happen. Because they're just sabotaging it and they don't want you to cut them out of their life for good. Alright, bottom of the deck. Wolf, Guardian, you are safe and protected at all times. Raccoon, Raccoon, resourcefulness, you have all the resources you need. Dove, serenity, ah, the serenity. Slow down, pause and breathe. And Badger, Perseverance, dig in and see it through to completion. So they're not giving up. They're not giving up. They want to, yeah, they want to see this through. But they want the peace between you two. They want to slow things down and just breathe in your energy is what I'm hearing. They know that they have all the resources to make something happen with you, and yeah. They really want to protect this connection this time. I think they see the value of it now. But I don't know. I mean, they're wanting that forgiveness here. I just don't see the work being put in. That's the only problem. Or maybe we'll see it here. Three of Wands. Seven of Pentacles. That's good to see. Page of Pentacles. Mm, judgment. Yeah. So yeah, right now they're waiting to come and invest in you. To, to make you an offer in person. Small offer to start with. To try and reconcile this situation. To bring it back together again. For a second chance. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Oh dear. I mean. Yeah. It's up to you if you want to talk to them. They want to talk. I think they've learned a lesson, but yeah, it's up to you. Yeah, look, sorry, I lied to you. Yeah, they know they stuffed up. All right, give me at least three cards for this love energy. We'd like to say to Sagittarius, please. And we got them. Oh, there we go. Exactly what I said. 
So we have I was raised not to show emotion. Ah. Maybe they were raised to see being emotional is, you know, weak. So they didn't show emotion to you. They might have acted really cold. They're going to stop doing that because they know it sabotages the situation. But yeah, they know they didn't show you emotion like they should have. And look, I will contact you soon. Yeah, because can we talk? Exactly what I said. They want to talk. Yeah. So they're going to reach out to try and talk to you. Mm, oh, look at this. Can we at least be friends? They're really begging to not be kicked out of your life. Lying was easier than telling the truth. Yeah, th I think they made up excuses instead of getting to the truth of the re and the reality of what was really going on before. I can't give you what you want. I should have told you how I felt, yeah. They know they should have told you how they felt and showed emotion towards you, but they couldn't do it. And so they just lied and, you know, I'm just hearing made up excuses rather than opening up and speaking the truth about how they felt. Now they're just hoping that you can at least be friends, you know. Well, that you won't hate them for it more than, you know. Like, hey, friends, good buddies, hang out together. No, it's just... Don't hate them, is what they're hoping. You know, at least be on friendly terms. Okay. Yeah, look at the bottom of here. Friendship. <sighs> yeah, that's what they're wanting. All right, message for you, Sagittarius, from the universe. What does Sagittarius need to know? Could be something general. Could be something to do with this. Mm, you got a few. Alright. So you have mother healing. Ooh. As your feelings toward your, your mother heal, your desires manifest more rapidly and accurately. That won't be for everybody. I also see this as the feminine side of yourself. But for some of you, you may have some mother healing you need to do. Treasure chest. An unforeseen windfall of new abundance comes to you now. Ooh, look out, Sagi. Bit of a treasure chest going to land in your plate. That's nice. Some sort of abundance coming to you. Hopefully it's an abundance in a positive way. <laughs> well, it's a windfall, so it's usually financial, but yeah. And break free. Try different ventures and experiences as a way to grow and learn. Yeah, so you just need to get out. Get out and try something new. Or learn, just learn something new. Try something new. Yeah, experience something new it's, to make it, you know, make you feel a bit refreshed <laughs> rather than the same old, same old. I'm hearing that, gotta get a break from the same old, same old. It's that poison, nothing but a good time. Don't need nothing but a good time. But yeah, I'm just hearing that. Time to get a break from the same old, same old. Yeah. Bottom of the deck, morning affirmations. Say positive affirmations each morning to open the gates of manifestation. Yeah, always a good way to start the day. Synchronicity. Your prayers and questions are being answered by synchronistic events. Notice them in order to increase their flow. Hmm, so keep an eye out for that. Make a decision. Feeling stuck or indecisive? Listen to your intuition and make a decision. You're also getting answers through these synchronicities, so, and trust your gut here. And a new dawn. 
The worst is now behind you and a positive new and positive new experiences are on the horizon. So yeah, get out and try those new new things. New new thing. Yeah, the worst is behind you. So go out and start doing new things. Make those decisions. Your intuition and the universe are trying to give you the answers that you're looking for. And just start your day as positive as you can, Dale. You've got a windfall coming in. And for those who need to do that mother healing, um, yeah, all the best with that. Hope it works out. All right. So, yeah, someone wants to come back and get your forgiveness by the looks of it. So, yeah. Well, it's up to you. All right, well, that's your reading. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, all you cheeky buggers that haven't hit that subscribe button, which is free. It doesn't cost you anything. It takes two seconds. Come on. <laughs> Cheekies. And, um, yeah, feel free to comment, but be nice in the comment section. Let me know. You know I'm enjoying these new readings. Uh, it's so much fun faster it's yeah it's great still get the great messages out but yeah quicker all right well thanks for watching all the best take care good luck and i'll catch you later